What's up guys, Jay Fancy here. Welcome to a brand new video for today. Today I'll be teaching you guys how to install and download and get Ubisoft Connect on your Steam Deck. I know everybody's hyped for X Defiant, so I'm gonna show you what I use to play X Defiant on my Steam Deck. So let's get right to it. First thing first, you wanna go to the discovery part, right? So you wanna go to discovery. Once you hit the discovery, you type in Lutris. R I S. You can enter and you install this right here. Okay. You install this. I already have this installed already, but you go hit to discovery and install this. Boom. Okay. So after that, you will exit. You will open this. And this will show up. Okay. But if you're a show white, how so you change it to dark this is the first thing i think you should do when you first get this go to preference and you go to this part right here as you can see it goes from this i don't know if this gonna change on on here but we're about to see but yeah i keep this dark so you check for this and change this on if it's white okay so boom exit that you're in this part so how to install you suck connect you go from right here you click on this right on your screen it's going to show like this uh let me go put this connect it's going to show this little thing right here connect to ubisoft and this is going to show this prompt that shows up right here you click okay and once you see this you want to choose this one that says wine latest and you want to click install then if you want to create shortcuts or anything, you can, but you don't have to. It's really up to your personal preference. You click continue. And then you click um, install to download. Your answer might be faster, so this might happen a lot more quicker. Okay, then it's going to install the game data. And you just wait till all this, everything is finished doing what it was doing. And I'm show you the next step afterwards. Okay, then it's gonna say install complete. So once you do that, you close it, you don't launch it yet. It's a, it's a reason why I say that. And you go to, you scroll down and show Windows and see if it shows, right? So okay, the first thing you wanna do, this is, I had issues with this. So you wanna click on this, and then you're gonna see this part in the bottom. That's how you know it's clicked. And then you press the, um, the left trigger, it's configured. And you want to turn, this off and this off because for some reason when i have this on it doesn't work at all and it doesn't load up and then if it does load up it keeps closing out and it closes back in okay and you click save okay next step you want to click is on wine and you want to click on this icon right here okay and right trigger that so what i use i install this version because i use this for something else like epic games or whatever you have installed that you want to use and by the way, this stuff does work for any other launcher that runs on this um, launcher, Lutris, okay? So I have this one installed right here, and this is the one I use for Ubisoft, and it works perfectly fine. So after you have this installed, you just click the install button, and it should start downloading, okay? So you click exit, you click on this, you right trigger on it, I mean left trigger on it, and then you press configure, run this options, you see, this is already set to this one right here, okay? Because I had this downloaded before. I make sure this stuff works before I just make the video. Click Save. And after that, you go click on Ubisoft Connect. And then you click on this icon. And when this pop up, you need to log into your Ubisoft account. And then you put, click on Remember. See, mine's already show, show right here. See, welcome back. And I just press Continue, right? Okay, so this part right here. I don't know why I did that, so I'm gonna put my password in and I'm gonna come right back, okay?
Okay, once you log in, you will see all these your games pop up that you have played or linked to you through either Xbox, PlayStation, or whatever, you know? All of that will show now. And you can install games from right here. You see X Defiant is, is the game I played recently, and it's right here, okay? So once you log in, the first thing you want to do is go to Windows. You want to click on this. Oh, by the way, before I do that, you can install games from this section too, okay? But this is the steps I took to make sure that this worked because I had had issues with this at first. So you want to click on this, and you want to press play. Sometimes it takes some time to boot up. Okay, you. Okay, and they will ask for you to log in again on your Ubisoft on this part too. So you just pick, click your password and stuff in again, and make sure you click remember. I'll do that right now. Okay, once you click log in, this prompt just shows up right here, and then you just click skip. And it's going to show this part right here, initializing. And once that finished, this should load up to Ubisoft. So now we are in Ubisoft at the moment. You see, it shows everything, it works perfectly fine. So, you the first step I would do, I'm going to show you that games does work on here. So. These are the games I tested, as you can see, I already have them downloaded, but I could re-download this Child of Light real quick to show you that this does work. And also, I will show you how you guys can put it in game mode too, so this will make it easier. Okay, so I'm going to download this game. Okay, once the game complete and you have your game that you, a choice that you want to download, click exit. And before you do that, you exit the um, part. If you one of the people like to see like FPS or whatever, I have um, display SPS counter on the top left. That's if you want to do that, but you don't have to. Okay, so I'm gonna finish the next part of the video on my phone because I'm about to show you guys how to do it in game mode to have like the pictures and everything to match. So switching over. Out. Okay, now we're on the second part. I'm gonna show you exactly how to get your Lutris to look like this. So you press the start button and you go to change artwork and you choose the icons you want. So I chose this one and then for wide, I chose this one right here. And then for hero, you could choose the background for hero. I'm gonna show you, show you where that, how that looks. How does that look like? And for logo, you choose your logo, and then for your icon, you choose your icon that you have. You can change your artwork through here, okay? And that's how I was able to look like this. When I click on this, you see the background is right there. You see the icon for Lutris is right here on the Steam Deck. So, I'm going to show you that the game works. So, you go to, you click on play. Okay? Before you do that, actually, I made a mistake. Let me go back. Let me exit out. Okay, so you want to change your control pattern, so you want to change the gamepad with mouse trackpad, okay? Make sure you do that first. That was my mistake, so now you're going to launch the game now. So, okay, now the game is launched. Use the trackpad to click on Ubisoft Connect. You click on Play, and it's going to um, pop up and run. This is in game mode. Once you're in the game mode, you click on the game that you installed. Like I installed this game right here, and I press A. And 
And it's going to do an installation because this is my first time launching this game. See, and you're in the game. So you click on the any button, the A button, and there you go. You press it. You start the game up, and you see the um, the FPS indicator is right here. So y'all can see me, you know. Yeah. And there you go. The game is working. As you can see, it plays good in the Steam Deck. Looks good. I tried this game out earlier before I made this video. This feels amazing. The quality is good. I know the FPS is kind of high. You know, the screen is 60 frames per second. But if you have a monitor, you can plug it in and you could get these frames 100%. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, thank you all for this amazing support and everything you've been um, helping me out with these videos, helping me stay motivated. So, I love you all. JFence is out. And we all have this thing, dude.